Hello, my name is Adoni Rafael with the Avaya Serviceability Engineering Team. This video is about how to enable Telnet access on the Avaya ERS 2500. There are many reasons for enabling Telnet access on the ERS 2500. Telnet allows remote access to the system with a terminal emulator. All configuration tasks on the system can be performed using CLI via Telnet. Telnet can be used in a secure network environment, such as LAN. The default setting for Telnet access is disabled. We'll go through these steps to enable Telnet access on the ERS2500. First, we'll log into the system with rewrite privilege using the RW user account and password. Then we enter the privilege exec mode with enable and the global configuration mode with conf t. Then to enable telnet access, we are using the command telnet access enable. As an option, you can set telnet inactivity timeout using the command telnet access inactive timeout followed by the number of minutes, which can be an integer from 0 to 60. Then we save the configuration changes with save config. Finally, we are going to verify telnet access setting with show telnet access. I'm logging into the EIS2500 with the rewrite login privilege using the RW user and password. At the command prompt, I enter the privilege exec mode with enable, then the global configuration mode with conf t. Then I enable telnet access using command telnet access enable. Let's set the inactivity timeout for the telnet session using command telnet access inactive timeout 30. So the telnet session will timeout after 30 minutes of inactivity. Then we save the configuration changes with save config. And finally, let's verify that telnet access is enabled with the command show telnet access. Here, the telnet access is enabled. And here is the inactivity timeout, which is set to 30 minutes. As you can see, enabling telnet access on the ERS 2500 is a quick and easy process. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avai.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details and other technical information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.